is brought to you by C2. Which can life be this now? I need to pour this thing come off for body before it turns something else. I just want to break the course on me. What course? There's one church not too far from our street, and the pastor majors on deliverance work. You can give it a try. I mean breaking the course of virginity, man. I won't lose the team, nobody for light, I beg. Before we start having stomach ache. Church cannot help you with that one, oh. Oh, there. No, I was thinking that church would encourage me to fornicate. Mumu like you. See, 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 see. Your crush is coming. The babe mad, go. You go fear of now. She makes sense die. Today is the day. I have to ask her out. Or die, not die. Oh, my God. Hey, lady. My name is John. But my friends call me Johnny. I love what I see and I can't resist it anymore. Babe, let me know you more. Can I have your digits? Digits? I mean your number, Joe. Are you sure you are capable of taking good care of a fine lady like Will me? Will you keep quiet? Because I don't give broke boys my number. You have to be more than capable before you can date me. How old are you? Because you look small to me. I can be any age you want me to be. Just Why? give me your digits yeah, and I will show you great things. I mean the power of money and what can be done during role play. Mm. So you can role play? Yes now. That is where I made you. See you soon. I can't believe she gave you her number. Ha <laughs> ha. Call me ladies man now. I'm smooth like that. They don't know. This is my house, Sha. Ah, I'm so hot. Well, I could change that situation if you let me. How? I told you I could role play. Oh. What are you doing? Getting ready to make you change from hot to warm. Oh, you want to roll the fan for me? Thank you so much. Yeah, darling. Uh, 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 oh, yeah, uh, nah. I thought you said you are good in role play. Play the role of a fan, please. Roll the fan, nah. Ah, ah, ah. Actually, I had a better method. I wanted to use to drive away the heat. No, I like this one. Keep rolling the fan. Don't stop, oh. Roll it faster now so I can feel the breeze. <laughs> My amiable hand fan. Hand fan self better. You turn yourself to roll on. Johnny the roll on. Johnny the heat killer. Killer heat man. Chai! Oko. There's beauty and there's beauty I beg. You do know you just basically said the same word. Not the same word though. One has capital letter B. Why the other one has small letter? Am I supposed to be looking for the one with capital letters inside your mouth? Eh? Or there. If you had any sense of reasoning left, you would recognize the one I lay more emphasis on. All this English and psycho lesson where you the yarn. You for don't use and toast the babe since you dare hear the yarn of pata. Hey, hey. Why must it be a man toasting a woman? This responsibility society plays on man gone no funny, I beg. He had pa. <laughs> I can see it's very hard. Now why you turn yourself into hand fan that year? But this girl is the one man. See how she said. To grieve for my case now problem. Why do you always have eyes on what you know is above your level? Eh Johnny? See me now. I go for my level. Like that girl. Make I go run I'm now. You don't know how I feel seeing you here today. This guy. Can't you get it? When the woman says she's not interested in you? The heart wants what it wants, Linda. Give me a chance. Starting with your number. Okay, fine. I'll give you a chance if you prove how useful you can be to me. <laughs> Linda, my middle name is useful. I will do anything just to prove my love to you. My birthday is coming up next tomorrow. Prove to me that you can be a man to me. Mm, that. <laughs> so that's the way 
sound like thunder and I slap you be. And now your face is land. <laughs> so you know tell me see your spec, na daughter of Amadioa. Jesus. Your mouth is running now, Abi. That you were not slapped does not mean that yours went any better. Hey man, don't compare our scenarios. Though. She gave me her number. Close your mouth, Joe. Make fly for no enter. I just need to show her my love on her birthday. I don't understand. To show love on birthday, now money then they take show love. Oh. And you and I know say you know get back accounts. We must show, my guy. We must show. It won't use your man who do ritual. Because now only your man will you get for this life. And that one we never even sure say it the work. Oh, we now we, I beg. We must show. <laughs> Guy, guy, waiting now. What did they find? I'm looking for something I can sell. I need money to show Linda how much I love her. Whoa, you have decided to sell your manhood. No, Joe. I have told you that you have nothing of what except your manhood. Do you think those iron condemn Aboki? Can I agree to buy this shovel? You decrease. What did I talk? You decrease. Yeah, yeah, they smell. If anything happens to those shovels, I will personally murder you. And don't ever disturb my sleep again. Yeah, Gani. I beg, run me one alone back for there. Mom, baby, let me this your glass. Eee, my glass, my glass. Eee, eee, I never wear. Help me, help me, help me. I'm blind. Please help me. I need food to eat. Help me, help me. I'm blind. I need food to eat. God will provide for you. God will bless you. Help me, help me. I'm blind. I need food to eat. Help me. Help me. Help me. I'm blind. Please help me. I need food to eat. Help me. Help me. I'm blind. I need food to eat. God will provide for you. God will bless you. Help me. Help me. I'm blind. I need food to eat. Let me take a break. The next one shower is not before returning for work. Johnny, where have you been? I went to hustle money. <laughs> hundred, two hundred, five hundred, six hundred, one thousand, one thousand, two hundred. Johnny, who did you steal from? What kind of rubbish talk is that now? Why would you call me a thief? I mean, your head don't twist. No vex now, no vex. Oh yeah, where you see money? Now wow, where you see the shades from? Drop the glass, Jerry. You resemble your own. See, now just one small side also I see do. You know if you do am. Say you have a special organ. Which kind of CV you they run for me now? No vex now, no vex. I just don't wonder they can't work where you feel do and not if you do me. No vex around me. I want rest more. Wake me up by 3.30 p.m. You better wake yourself. I they go site. You no plan to come site today with that. I know they come. Okay. Hope say this was a show. Cause if they replace you, you have to come back. Oh. Jesus, this dream is an inconsiderate dream. Oh. 
How will I make the money to stray Linda? If the dream cannot pause for me to wake up on time and go and make the money. I'm blind. Please help me. I'm blind. Please help me with anything you have. God will bless you. God will bless you. Help me. Help me. I'm blind. Mommy, mommy, you take my glass. Will you stop that rubbish? Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. It's just a child. My glass. My glass. Give me my glass. Mommy, my glass. Ah, ah, Johnny. Is this not Johnny? Oh my God. Oh. Johnny, you had your side this morning now. Huh? Stop it. Stop it. Can't you just work up us? Ah, sorry, yo. First alarm every day. You could see this money, yo, but now it's blind. Praise the Lord, though. Oh, sorry. No be testimony be this. Oh, can you? Dear Lord, you will collect your glass later. Let's go, Jerry. Whoa, Blind Bartimaeus, welcome. Oh. How many times did you cry to Jesus before you received your sight? So, the news don't reach here. Trust you, I got you now. <laughs> so, you turn blind beggar because you want to please Linda. Oh, guy, leave me, leave me, I beg. This Linda girl must love you by fire, by force. Oh. By hook or crony. I go send her this 20k now. Jesus, you mean you made 20k in one day? If I be more now, if to say that you got you and that are blockhead picking, no spoil show. Johnny, I beg now. Divide this money to, to make you give him half now. A uh, person like Linda no go appreciate 10k. Free 10k? 10k where she no work for. Food day? Eh? No food though. Come on money from your money, go buy food. No worry, I go drink water, sleep. Catch me. Catch me. Begin it, begin it, begin it. Catch me. Catch me. Hello people. I hope you're having a great time here today. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. So I think it would be nice to appreciate the person who sponsored this party. Come on, the person that kept this whole thing together. So, ladies and gentlemen, give him a round, a rousing round of applause as it comes forward. Uh uh, who are all these people? See, I beg, I beg. If anybody wants to start any generation, it should not be you. You said if. I only said what I said because I needed extra help for this birthday bash. Otherwise, you're not up to my level. So, I beg shift. Please, I, 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 I can explain. <laughs> Johnny, what's your relationship status? It's complicated. Now, I'll get picky with that. Oh. Which Oga? You the one federal government, eh? How many work you get where you get past one Oga? Now, the owner of this building side picking with that. This is a no guess sense. Why I go want you? Is site manager not also an Oga? Ah! Thief! Thief! Ah! Ah! Thief! In anything you want to do, learn how to handle the pros and cons. How can you be a thief and not know how to run? Your mentor after an enemy should be using boots. Ha! An enemy cannot even be your mentor self. At least, thief better thing. Not a man bag with nothing but pad and tissue paper. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate. Johnny, Johnny, don't fall yet. It's not Bollywood. What is he saying? He's saying that his brain cells are dead. You deserve a reward for risking your life for me. <laughs> it was hardly to risk, Jerry. I will send you 30,000 Naira for sweating for me. It's true. I really took a great risk, Ja. A lot of sweat. Okun, please bring my towel for me. Where is the site manager? <laughs> He's not around, but Johnny is my friend. What? By this time of the day? Is he being paid not to be around? It is not easy being an ogre. Nonsense. He's fired. Johnny, 
From now on, you'll be the site manager. Eh? Ah, thank you. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, you deserve to be the site manager. After all what you have done for me today. Auntie, my name is Okon. Shut up, Joe. Leave me, oh. A closed mouth is a closed coffin. A closed mouth is a closed destiny, you should say. My own quote still makes sense, Sha. Please, can there be assistant site manager? I can also sweat for people too. In fact, sweating for people is my hobby. You have to earn it. Don't worry, your time will come. Thank you so much, ma. Call me Anita. Anita. Anita, 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 Anita. Anita, 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 Anita. What is the meaning of this? No vex. I thought you were having the first bouts of malaria. Ogbeni, okay, stand up. Oh. Let's go to work, Jerry. You can go. I will meet up with you. Oh, sorry, you. Oh. Oga manager. Do you know what happens when individuals are elected into power? What? They carry their family and friends to eat a piece of the national cake. Oh! Oh, key you there. You cannot tell me to suspend work for a while and rest. You just made all of us to be working since morning. Isn't that what you came to do? And don't forget that I'm your boss. I beg, make with the go house. Your government is useless. She showed her back well, though. Me? You cannot run today, though. I thought the superpowers would be forever. Shut up. She's almost here. Hi, Johnny. Okon. I thought you'd be done with work by now, so I can drop you off at home and treat you to dinner. Your house? No, your house. I don't understand. Yeah, yeah. So you don't understand sarcasm. She means her house, Joe. She wants to treat us with dinner. No, I mean your house. Your house. I got dinner in the car, and I would like to drop you in your house. Ah, madam. Anita. Anita, in my area, they will not only steal your bag. They will also steal your cow. And they can also kidnap you. Just give us the dinner here. And we will remember you in our hearts as we are eating it. Yes, it will look like we have your presence with us. <laughs> I insist on knowing your house. Come on, let's go. I hope you at least swept the house. That our black pot did the middle of the room. You know how you got spa powers to catch teeth, Abby? Better find the spa powers that will make it disappear. Oh. You can still change your mind about coming in. Come on. Your place can't be that bad. Okay. I didn't imagine it would be this empty. Is that a pot for local herbs? It's a cooking pot. And Johnny's supposed to be the caretaker. Ah, shut up. Anita. If I knew you were coming, I would have made some efforts. Hmm. I hope you are not the kind of man that depends on a woman to be, you know, practice proper hygiene. It was just today. Anyway, let's eat. <laughs> you learn very fast. Guy, make sure you behave yourself. Today, we eat like responsible adults. Small, small. So... You can still eat like someone that still has a functioning brain. Lie, lie. Devil no go use you to make me stone you this precious food. You don't deserve it, I swear. <laughs> Thank you again. Drive safe. Thanks, man. Don't mention. Yes, yes, I'm happy. You. I won 500k this morning. And I'm going to collect the money right away. Eh? This boy don't win lottery again. Let me go and collect my rent too. 
since our overhead this boy has 1500k and this stupid boy has been owing me two years rent and has no plan of paying me god uh, the money for that business is one million naira and i'm not collecting it twice Fella! Fella! Open the door before I break the door. Come and pay me my rent, yo. You know you are owing me two years' rent. Fella! Fella, more come, you know, open the door. Oh! Who is there disturbing my sleep and shouting at my door? You know, tell me, see, I don't will my room for you. Useless tenants, only this is jati jati. Come on, open the door. Oh, Baba Lalot, now you. Why you they disturb my sleep now? Where's my two years rent? Baba, I don't have any money with me. And they see my period bad bad though. No, the only period you they see. You supposed to wait till past period. You are a bloody liar. You think I didn't overhear everything you said on the phone about 500 k So please go inside and give me my two years rent. <laughs> <laughs> overhead ready. Me wait all the sleep this morning. Maybe you had me sleep talking. Because I be the dream about money before you scatter my dream for me. I suppose sue you for not allowing me to collect the money in my dream. Ah, you also talk in your dream. Double wala for you. Don't you know that it is a taboo to sleep talk in my house? And you are still owing me two years rent again. Ah, you are a serious trouble, oh fella. What is it, Baba Landlord? I'm not even owing you two years rent, oh. It is one year and ten months now. But, uh, plus this month it will be level. Don't have to eat, oh, Baba. I beg. You are not serious, so what is the difference between two years and one year and eleven months? Pay me my money, Baba Landlord. I will give you next week by God's grace. Uh, it's like I'm expecting some money next week. Please bear with me. It's like I be. Don't worry. Next week we we'll come and go. How I wish I'm a woman now. Why? You would have made the motivation to make that fan work without electricity now. It is not hard though. You can cut off the things that makes you a man. I haven't recovered from that food I entered brought yesterday. As I did yes, who I did dream about himself. Continue dreaming with your eyes open. No go find Gary drink. Yesterday was Christmas. Today na Monday. When my life go upgrade like this, I need better food I beg. Are you expecting anybody? Never people. Landlord. Down my way the sweep compound where we never pay. Baba mostly live for the water where we fetch. We never pay. Shh. Hello? The door you are knocking on. Nobody is around. Please try again later. Or never. You did mad. Johnny, it's me, Anita. 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 Don't mind us, oh. We are just realizing how we will create our own house house machine. That's all. We were not hiding from our landlord at all, or from Nepal people, or... or you could sit down. I bought these groceries for you guys. There is some food in there too. I figured you might need them. It's nothing much. Hello guys, what are you thinking? I want to marry you. Oh, I want to say thank you. Yes, thank you. Thank you very much. It's nothing. I have to go now. I'll see you guys later. Let me see you off. Thank you again, Anita. I don't know what I did to deserve this kindness from you. Oh, please. It's nothing. Uh, 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 <coughs> I didn't mean to. <clears throat> I'm so... Don't be sorry. Bye. Ah, I will marry that girl. Eh? I must marry that girl. What lie? If you eat my head again, now 600 years of suffering for you.
<laughs> Why are you laughing, qua qua qua? Oh, mo, you truly sound like a chicken, though. Anyway, Anita is cracking me up on chats. You know your problem? No, Professor Daddy. Your problem is that you don't always go after your size. See this video. Watch I'm well, though. Who would ever believe that the chicken would try to fight a cow? That's what my case be. You get mad to talk because you know Kuku know how the video take end. Hmm. Or more. One day, as I walk, when I go just see say I melt, this one will be here. Oh, that supervisor. I'm going no more. Anita is here. Hi, guys. I came to check on the work. I can see progress. <laughs> it is the Lord's doing. Which Lord's doing? Please, though, oh, it is me and other workers doing, though, under the sun. You know, get right to apportion work, give the Lord. When you they sit down for shade, they do supervise some. It's okay. You listen to your flu. Whichever one it is, Okon, it is marvelous in my sight. I see you guys are ready to go home. Yes, so I don't melt finish. You should come to our place. I have something for you. Really? Yes. Okay. Let's go then. I can't wait to see it. Johnny, that is not a good thing to give to this kind girl. Oh. No share our garden with this babe finish. Oh. Why is your mind so small? Because our garden is small. We have food this. That is where the mind is so. Oh. I need to go meet up with some guys. No finish this more Gary. Wow. It's lovely. It's lovely. I'm glad you think so. I made it myself. Wow. I just wanted to find a way to appreciate you. And I know that I won't be able to afford what you truly deserve. The thought is what counts. Have dinner here. Let me prepare something for us. Have you ever heard of concussion rice? No. <laughs> Sounds like something a native doctor would do. But if you are cooking it, I'm willing to try it. How long have you been doing that? Does time exist? Very funny. I must have fallen asleep because of your concussion rice. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually nice. I have to go now. Thanks for tonight. Thanks for everything. I really appreciate. Uh, uh, I will see you off. Were you hurt by traffic? No, <laughs> road was free. Oh, I was just wondering why you came home late though. Where did you get this ugly thing? Hmm. It all started with the first meeting of this gentleman. So you're telling me you have started to develop strange undefined feelings for someone who was funny with the Anne fan? Yes, I, I mean, no, not exactly. How exactly, please? I mean, I slept off in his place. And instead of thinking of how to take advantage of me in that vulnerable state, he was rather thinking of how to make me comfortable to the best of his abilities. Now, wow. I mean, we've got to admit that that act of manually giving me air was very gentlemanly. What is gentlemanly is him being able to afford an air condition that won't make you sweat in the first place. Anything other than this is just poverty speaking. 
I don't even expect you to understand, Seth. Of course. Not when you have shown who gives you everything. Not everything. There is just something missing. Like what? I don't know. I can't really put a name to it. You have what most girls are dying to have and you're looking for missing invisibility. Anybody that wants to die to have him can have him, I beg. <sighs> I'm off to bed. Good night. You won't eat? No, I'm full. You know, he, he cooked concussion rice for me to eat. Concussion rice? Then this idiot necklace that looks like something carved by Amadioa to terrorize the earth. Hmm, I see. See what? The guy is a native doctor and you have been charmed. <laughs> Stop being silly. Johnny, I beg. I won't be feeling fine tomorrow, so I won't be coming to work. Johnny, I'm not joking. I swear, I'll be very sick tomorrow. Guy, this place is not the place to be watching porn now. You did, Chris. Oh, so you hear me since you did ignore me. It is not your sickness prediction that is doing me a beg. If you like, predict your death. It's your business. See, I'm asking Gugu how to woo a lady without having money. <laughs> Wrong question, my friend. Wrong question. You should ask Gogo how to have sense without having money. See what this blog says. It says, be straight, be witty. I can be witty now. That Yami does not make you witty, yo. It also says, sing to her. Error, error, error. Bing, bing, bing. Be neat and keep a great fashion sense. The pot where you never wash for two days now, still the house, oh. That fashion sense side there. Eh? We go just use marker, write the words, great fashion, for the back of this our bricklayer clothes. Now the only way you fit get great fashion sense. The blog also says to stay away from useless friend. I exist in your life to restore your brain to factory setting. You need a me in your life. You are here? Of course I am here. I came to take you out. Take me out. Why? Mm, let's just say I want to return the favor of cooking concussion rice for me. <laughs> you don't have to. I insist. Uh, uh, I can't go out like this. I have to shower and change. Okay then. I'll drop you off and wait for you to do all that. You are really serious about this? You bet I am. Guy, where are you? Make with the go out so... Did you know that meat tastes differently when eating with hands? <laughs> How did you know this? Experience and Wikipedia. Uh, okay, let's eat chicken with our hands then. See, how is that? <laughs> tastes better. Your experience and Wikipedia are a genius. Don't mind me. I'm not used to being in this kind of place and eating chicken with my hands. I just try to use humor to cover my inability. So fit in, so my complaint does not trip you off. Oh, come on. You don't have to cover anything with me. Being yourself is enough company, Johnny. <laughs> that compliment has removed the last restraint I had on this pee. <laughs> Why would you hold your pee? This place looks too clean. It feels like a taboo that there will be anything like toilet here. <laughs> I'm a local man. I know. The restroom is towards the left, Johnny. I wanted to grab dinner and I saw my lady sitting here. Who are you here with? Julie? Uh, actually... Uh, please, can I? Yes, you can have my holder. 
I want rice with beef stew and a bottle of red wine, please. Sean is not a waiter. He's a friend and the person I came with. Bam. What? How would you feel if me as your boyfriend huh? took a lady out to this kind of cozy restaurant? Exactly what I thought. Now let's go home. You shouldn't be here. It's just my friend. Women do not keep friends with their opposite gender. Especially when you are in a relationship. He doesn't speak well of you. What would your father think of this? <sighs> let's go now. I, I'm, I'm, I'm so... I said let's go now. Debuse, Anita. Ah, ah. Anita. Debuse. Uncle, uncle, eh, it is not me that brought myself here. Oh. It's that sister that I just left. See, I'm an honest citizen, you know. If I tell you I will come back tomorrow to pay, I will surely come back. Ha! Ah. Ha! Ah. All these things I'm saying is falling on deaf ears, Abby. <laughs> How was the date now? Who said it was a date? What else was it? A girl took you out, waiting in one column. We went for a meeting. Okay. How was your meeting? Wait, though. Why are you smiling like money fresh liquid soap like this? Must you turn everything to yab? I just had the great night of my life. And you want to ruin it? Now, question I ask now. No vex. You know bring anything come for me. Guy. No vex. No vex, nah. No vex. I just they play with you. Omo. Wait in your hand. Why he pee? Okon, God will deal with you one day. I just get concerned because the hand be like something where person use the practice how to pee yam. Oh God! I don't know why you're making a big deal out of this. Can't I have dinner with a friend? Have you had dinner with Julie, your female friend, before? In a cozy restaurant like that? Oh, stop blowing this out of proportion. I'm starving. I wonder why you stay with her. We vibe together better than you do with her. You have nothing else to offer me other than vibes and inshallah. Marrying Anita would increase my social ladder. You know that. Now, tell me who this guy she was with today is. Just some guy that walks in one of her father's sites. She speaks fondly of him. So, he is a threat. A laborer cannot be a threat to you. If you speak fondly of him, and then they went to that kind of restaurant. Then you are dumber than I thought to think he is not a threat. <laughs> you are the one bully, you no? Know. You are the one looking like a bowler. When did you learn to wind someone? Anyway, I'll leave you lovers alone. You didn't even bring food for me. You didn't say you wanted to eat now. Babe, don't land. She's not my babe. Oh. Johnny, I'm so sorry for last night. I didn't mean for any of it to happen. Of course. Please forgive me. Let me make it up to you again. Ah, please, so oh. I don't want to watch drums of late again, no. I, I I don't understand. The food we ordered now. How would I have paid when you suddenly left with your boyfriend?
Juni, I'm so sorry. It's not fair now. It just made me to start thinking about my life. Oh, Johnny, I'm deeply sorry. Your boyfriend is here. Your boyfriend is here. Your dad sent me to check out this project. Why would my dad send you here? I'm handling it. Handling it in an intimate org with your employee. You don't know anything. I know what I saw. I saw you just now hugging this riffraff tightly. And you say you are just friends. Oh, please, don't make a scene unnecessarily. A scene? Did you just say I shouldn't make a scene? Is there any scene compared to the scene you just made with your worker? That thing that is on your mind, don't say it if I will break your head. Okay. Well, at least I know we won't be having dirty plates lying around the room again. Where is that riffraff distracting my woman? I don't know any riffraff. I said, where is the riff? riff the the, the, the riff go piece. The, the riffraff go piece, oh. You? You think I don't know what you are doing? You want to weave your way into Anita's life so she will upgrade your level, right? I will advise you once. Pitch your tents elsewhere or else. Homo, says I shake for you. I'm shaking from your tread, though. I'm shaking, go, go, they catch me. Oh, you not too much. You think it's a threat, eh? Let me see you near her again. How will you and Anita be dating this name compu? The same way at the activities you see for your own body, maybe she gets bad taste. Sir, Anita is really getting on my nerves. How can she be trying to build a relationship with your staff? A liberal for that matter. My daughter? It can't be my daughter. You are the one I approve for her. She can't disobey me. From this side? It looks that way, sir. I will talk to her. Don't worry. What is this that I'm hearing about you and one of my workers? That I ask you to oversee a side does not mean you should stoop so low to befriend one of the staff. So, I can't be friendly with a staff? Such relationship is destroying your relationship with Sean. You must end it at once. Why do you always want to dictate everything about my life? Because I know what is the best for you. I have told you what to do. I don't want to hear of this matter again. <laughs> So, Sean reported me to my father. <laughs> so, I'll have my father control my life. Sean wants to join him too. <laughs> what are you going to do? Do the exact opposite of what they want me to do. This rubbish of controlling my life has to stop. I am an adult for Christ's sake. An adult that knows what she wants. And Sean is not what I want. Is it Johnny? Is that what you want? Uh, hello, Cone. Good evening. Johnny, I'm here to take you out. At least to say sorry for the other day. I want to make it up to you. Let me check my schedule. Mm, no, I'm very busy. Johnny, please. Let me check his schedule. Mm, yes, yes. His calendar is cleared. You want her to need her and beg you before you collect. If you know what I suffered the last time, eh? Omo, you go pity me, oh. On any plate where you wash, you will be Superman where they catch thief. They cry for ordinary plates where you wash. I promise, nothing like that would happen this time. Nobody will whisk me away this time. Fine, 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 fine. Where are we going? Do you know how to drive? No. Come on, tell me something about you. <laughs> There's really nothing about me. 
Everybody has something about them, no matter how small. Uh, something like what? I, I don't know. Something that will make me feel like I really know you. <laughs> I miss the back-to-back -back hits Moritz gave us. There is no group in Nigeria that has done it close or even better than them. Ooh, finally! Someone who shares my thoughts. That group was fire. Yeah, they are proof of the sad reality that nothing lasts forever. Well, at least they gave us music that would outlast them. Make I tell them the coco, make I tell them the coco. Then what about this one? Every time I see your body, yeah, it's, it's more than just again. <laughs> Good times. But I want to know something deep about you. Tell me about your family. Well, my father was a rector before he died. Oh, I'm so sorry. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It happened when I was young. I can't even remember his face. So what about your mom? Died giving birth to me. <gasps> oh my! So who raised you? My uncle. He took me in and then sent me away when I was 18. Why? He said I needed to learn how to fend for myself. But I suspect he does not want me to claim the inheritance my father left in his care till I come of age. I had heard him talk about it to a man who came visiting. <sighs> So, why don't you want to go and claim what's yours? I confronted him about what I had, and he said I was hallucinating. I don't know. Besides, even if it were true, how would I have been able to handle anything called wealth? Do you want to remain a bricklayer forever? That's not the plan. So, what's the plan? Uh, um, actually, I don't know. I've never thought of it. Well, you should. Come up with a plan for your life. What do you really want to make out of your life? Baba Ali woman, make we enter house, plan better thing for our lives. What to jam me for it? Guy, guy, guy. I know they mood for ya, I beg, I beg. No vex so. I just the wonder where to make your head suddenly they think right. So, we got stuck waiting we go do. I've been thinking on my way home that we need to take this out of construction skills to a bigger level. How? I want us to go and meet all these big, big complaints and let them know we can do anything housing from building to wiring to plumbing so that anytime they need these things done, they will remember us. But they might have their own contacts already now. There's no harm in trying, Baba. There's no harm in trying. So, how do we start? Me too. But I think what we have drafted is a good place to start from. Mm. Johnny, eh? no vex or waiting I won't ask you. But waiting jam your head. Nanita jam my head. I see. Okun, as we want to start this thing, eh, we must not let anything distract us, especially women. No be money they even attract women. I did deal, Joe. Good. Because we must not be a bricklayer all our lives. I need to know everything about him. Especially his uncle and Johnny's inheritance. Allow us to do anything that has to do with your building, from electrical to plumbing to building to repair and even renovation. You would be glad you did. Who we are is simple, summarized in one word integrity. This is why we are focused on delivering quality work. Just leave your card and I will get back to you if anything comes up. Just leave your card. Not even a positive feedback. It is not supposed to be that easy, I guess. Anita, what are you doing here? How long have you been here? Not long. I was just about trying your number. Good evening, Anita. Good evening. 
Johnny, you need to meet up with your uncle. You were supposed to have claimed your inheritance at age 21. It's criminal of him to withhold it from you. These things you are explaining, how did you know about them? Well, after you told me your story, I was curious, so I hired a private investigator to look into it. How did he? Hey, I don't ask questions how he gets his job done, as long as it's done. Hmm. So what are you going to do now? I wish I was certain about what to do. Yeah, 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 please, please now, please, yeah, yeah, yeah. You were involved in this. I will do anything to restore sanity to you. I want you to stay away from him. You have no right to decide who should be in my life. It is not your life to live. You should mind the way you talk to your father. As you rightly put, my father, my father, not yours. What is he doing here? He's also involved in this. You can leave us. My body, yeah, 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 yeah. Please, please now, please. If you kill me, it will be waste of sin. Oh, my head cannot bring money. Wait, Anita, where's Anita? Anita, where's Anita? You talk too much. I need to personally teach you to get a name out of your mouth. Give me that. Yeah, yeah. My body, yeah, please. You stay away yeah, from her. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hello, sir. Release the young man. What? But just release him. Who just save you from my hands today? Boys, get him out of here. Johnny, sir. I, I... You are a thief, Abby. You ran away from where you were caught, Abby. No, sir. No, sir. When we get to the station, you will explain how you got these fresh bruises on your face. Oh, yeah. Enter the van. Sir, sir, sir. You don't understand. I'm not, I'm not. You want me to cause the police Bible for you. Anything you say can be used against you in the court of. Oh. Just enter the van, my friend. My guy don't use enjoyment with two man casting phone one side. <laughs> I need to see Johnny. Ah, uh -uh. you need to see Johnny K. Johnny that followed you out yesterday and stayed overnight with you. Do I seem like the person you should ask that question? You mean he didn't come home last night? Which kind of play be this? Hello, Dad. I thought you said you release him. Well, he, he hasn't be, been home since. Look, if anything happens to him, just forget you have a daughter in me, because I will never forgive you. You better find him fast. 
Eh? Come, come, come. Anita, where's my friend? It's a long story, Okon. But your best journey is missing. I'll feel you in the car, but we have to go now. How did you find me, sir? I have my ways. You don't need to be bothered about how I found you. However, I want you to be bothered about leaving my daughter alone. Because if you don't, what happened to you last night would be nothing compared to what I can stretch further to do. So, you and that, 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 that hoodlums in fine clothes did this to me. Sean is the best man for my daughter. He's capable of taking care of her. He comes from a family of money and he would ensure my daughter would not lack all that she is used to. You, on the other hand, you are just a common liberal. You have nothing to offer her. I have called my daughter and I have informed her that you are here. When she comes, you will tell her not to bother about you again. And in return, I will give you 5 million naira. 5 million naira? Yes, I know it's a lot for you. But I will do anything to keep my daughter more than comfortable for you. Even when she does not realize the good I'm doing for her. I'm sorry, sir. But I can't accept your money. But I will leave Anita alone. Not because of your threats. But because you are right in only one thing. That I don't have the means to take care of her and give her the life she is used to. Johnny! Johnny! Oh my god! Johnny! See my guy. Johnny, I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Oga, you're a wicked man. Oh. So now so all these big men be. Now God go judge you. In a sane society, you will not get away with this. But we are just liberals. Chai. Okon, it's okay. Let's go home. I, I, I'll drop you off. No, no, no. Don't bother. We can find our way home. Johnny. John, John, Johnny. <laughs> Chai, you for not reject the money. My honor is more important, I beg. Say poor man, they get honor. Ah, seriously, you know, try. You for collect a mass compensation for these beatings now. Nah. You? Johnny doesn't want to see you. And I can totally understand why. But please, let me just see him and at least apologize. You should leave. Johnny, please, I'm sorry. Okay. I've had the apology. I still think you should leave. And don't come back again. Johnny, please, don't do this. Don't do what? Wait. How did we even get to this point, Seth? Listen. We both don't have nothing to offer you. So the only reason you can be here right now is simply out of pity. And I don't need pity from you. So please, leave me alone. Okay? Okon, close the door, I beg. Have you been crying? What does it matter to you? You've got what you wanted. Johnny says he doesn't want to see me. Good. Since he was going to do that, why didn't he collect the 5 million era? Anyway, I get to keep my money. Wait. You offered him 5 million naira to leave me alone? Yes. And he refused. Such a foolish man. Oh my god. Dad. I need you to leave me alone right now. My one daughter chases me out of her house. You want to also have control of my house too? Don't you get tired trying to control everything and everyone in my life? I will leave now before you caught me with your words. How do I show this guy how sorry and grateful I am to him? How? I must make sure he gets his inheritance. That is the only way I can pay him back for all these troubles. Hello? Please find out everything there is to know about the job I gave to you. From the lawyer involved to the lawyer of his uncle, I want to know everything. I am here to give you an update you might not know about. Who are you? My name is Anita and I am trying to help a friend. Okay, I'm listening.
Hello. Right away, right away. You won't regret it, sir. Thank you, thank you, thank you, sir. What happened? One of those complaints we went to want us to undo the wiring of their new buildings. They have asked us to send quotation. But we don't really sabi wiring now. So we look for who can and had our profit in the quotation. Simple. Genius. Hot brain. Oh yeah, make we go find capable people. We fi undo this thing. Mado, so not like this person fit turn from zero account to plenty zero account. Ah, from grass to grace. Don't be smart, you know. Who did there? there? I bet bring one more bottle. Then hard ECU. Bring catfish pepper soup. Make sure say the catfish na big one, no. <laughs> go go finish the money for one sitting now. Nah. Na celebration with day to day, no fit finish. Aj. Johnny, don't pick it. Why? Have you not heard that it is when money comes that problem will go finish money they also come don't know why i still get surprised when you talk stupidly hello wow okay send me the address i talk calm when i they talk they will say okay and talk stupidly okay what is the problem that has made your face change that was my father's lawyer he said he wants to see me i had a feeling my father was wealthy but I don't know it was to this extent. We need to pay your uncle a visit. You are definitely more than of age to claim your inheritance. I doubt. He wouldn't want to give it to me like that. We will see about that. I called you here to tell you that it is time to pursue your master's degree and I want you to do it abroad. I thought this is what you have been always wanted. Why are you not excited? You're not doing this because you actually want me to go study abroad. But because you just want me to stay far away from Johnny. You just want to make sure I don't have any contact with him again. This boy again? Ah, say what you may. But I have arranged with an agency to get a good school for you. Where you will be doing your MBA. Your wish is my command. Can I go now? Johnny, I sent you out of my house for you to learn how to also and make money for yourself, not to try to be a ton in my flesh. Felicia, can't you see properly? Are you blind that you cannot watch your steps? Sorry, 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 sorry. It's okay. Are you okay? Yes, thank you. So, asking for my inheritance means I'm a tone to your flesh. Anyway, just hand it over. Then I'll be out of your face. Never. Never is impossible. You are not the head to your brother's wealth. His son is. You were only told to manage it till he comes of age, and he is of age. The appropriate thing is to hand it over or else. Or else what? I have managed all the properties to what they are today. They are worth more than when it was given to me, and you think I will just sign them off to someone who does not have an idea of how to manage anything? It is nobody's business if he knows how to handle anything or not, or how to manage it. What is our business is that the will says, his son should be given his inheritance. I don't care what the will says. I said no. You don't even have a case. If you do, you would have not come here empty-handed without papers to sign and the will itself. <laughs> what kind of a lawyer will I be if I do not have a copy of the will? A shitty lawyer. That's what I am. I cannot find a copy of that will. What? So, what am I doing here? I thought you wanted to help me. How will you, not having a copy, be of help to me? <sighs> Calm down. There shall be a way. Johnny, this is just they happen at once. So. First, we get contract. Second, you discover say your papa gets money pass as you imagine him. Me say I don't understand this level. But I will just concentrate on the one way I use my hand bring. 
Come my papa own. Oh, I don't have power to fight a beg. I go forget them. You dey mad. Forget waiting. If I land you slap, eh? That's not where loose for your head go straight. I beg, where your nepa money? Nepa be go come tomorrow to cut wire. Eh, I will give you tomorrow now. Ah, now on a snow gun be that. Tomorrow go come now. Person no go see on now. What is that one mean now? Nah? In fact, take the money, Joe. Now, wow. Mm. Yes, you can say the now again. You are permitted to be surprised. Levels don't change now. They know if he told me again, does a 10 over 10. Levels don't change now. They know if he stopped me again, number 10 over 10. See, you must not give up on getting your head at so. Not when I am still alive. We have people to pepe. People like Iya Abira who thinks we must always own Nepal Bill. Me, I still feel we could have gotten those wires for a cheaper price if we had looked elsewhere. You too like Waka. That was a good bargain. If we get anything cheaper, it won't be of a good quality. And less quality materials will spoil our business. Sorry about the shoes. Thanks. I don't mind carrying on my back, as far as your feet won't get dirty. <laughs> Thanks for the thought, though. Can I get your number so I can call you at least to know if you saw a shoemaker on the way? <laughs> you seem to laugh easily. I like that. My name is Okun. I'm Amanda. Give me your phone. Thank you. So where exactly are you heading to? Okun, I don't think there's any bus going our way from here. Let's move a bit further. Okay, bye-bye, Amanda. This one, you have known her name already. I hope you remember. No woman until we have blown already. We are already doing contract work. If this is not blue, I don't know what it is, though. Calm down. We have not blown yet. Anyway, that call I received was that last company we went to. They want us to handle the building in one of their branches. Hey! If we package ourselves more, eh? You will see this thing you call blue. It's nothing but a pinch. Eh? Hey, Johnny, I need to call. Didn't you understand it the last time? That I'm done with her. I just the ask now. Nah. Key the question, I beg. Ask that question. My mother just sent a message. She wants my sister to join me in Lagos. Does your mother know we are not too long struggling to survive? I bet me she never come home. They think that once you have entered the city, then you are comfortable. She should wait a little for when you have your own house. And then she can come and live with you. Hmm. <sighs> To live alone for one apartment could make sense, Sha. Imagine a life without smelling your mess. You know where? This is for you. This money is for what? To drop this issue. Come up with some law terms to dissuade the boy from coming after this inheritance. Why can't you just give the boy what belongs to him? And go back to doing what? Look, it's not as easy as it looks. Just accept this cash. I am sure it is more than anything the boy can ever pay you. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't do that. Take your money and give the boy what belongs to him. <laughs> You're a foolish lawyer. If you truly had something here, you would have been threatening me with a lawsuit by now. But it sounds as though you're begging for me to give the boy what is. Have a nice day, Mr. Lawyer. Come in. I didn't think you were actually going to come.
make money for yourself, not to try to be a ton in my flesh. Felicia, can't you see properly? Are you blind that you cannot watch your steps? Sorry, 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 sorry. It's okay. I can't go through the stress of pretending to fall on you so I could slip my number into your pocket without accomplishing the purpose why I did that. Right. So, how can I help you? That is all the document that makes you the heir to your father's assets and wealth. If he doesn't have that, he has no claim to the properties and everything becomes yours as it should be. Why are you doing this? I want him to return back to his senses. This money has since turned him into a madman who treats people like trash, including me. This money gives him power, dark power, and he isn't even the owner of it. I take this power away and he should remember he is nothing for a mere mortal. Wow! All I can say is thank you so much. I really appreciate. I have to go now before he returns and doesn't meet my presence. Wait! What if he suspects you to have taken the documents? Leave that for me to handle. To be very candid, I don't see a way through this without the documentations. Whew. Call me the lawyer and I will accept it at this point. There is no time for name calling or pity party. I believe that is what you need. All the documents you need. How did you... Let's just say God works in a mysterious way. Yes dear, I miss you too. Let's do video call now. I can't. Uh, you know I'm not staying in my own house now and I don't have that kind of privacy. What about the toilet? That's a privacy location by default settings now. So you want me to be inhaling toilet smell because I want to talk to man? <laughs> no now, don't worry. One of these days we will do video call. Okay, we will talk later then. How far? Oh um, uh, hey, I'm on my way to inhale my father's word to... Okpo, Okpo, I know say you make me proud one day, my guy. What did happen? Now you get the money. Story. Any money will be your own or my own. If you get money, it means say me self don't get money with that. I am a rich man. <laughs> Tomorrow, me and the lawyer, they go the uncle house. So... Everything go bam. Nothing must come in between you and our money. Our money. Money don't come. I don't make her. Ha! Naso! 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 So what do I with this visit? To let you know that you have a month to pull yourself together and evacuate this building and also hands off other properties belonging to Johnny's father. <laughs> you talk as one who has lost his senses. You talk as one who doesn't know the verdict, if this should make it to court. Those are the originals. You, you have the... Yes, I do. You have one month. One month? One month, okay? I think we should make it one day, self. Because this house is already sweating my body to live in. Let's stick to the one month. It's because of my lawyer. If not, this night says you are gone. No! Man, five duplex in Banana Island. Eight in Ikoyi. Nine plaza in Sunulere. Ha! Ah! So I have all this? Yes, it's all yours. Ah, lawyer, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I really appreciate. But how did you find me? I was told not to let him know this, but I have to. Someone by the name of Anita came to me and reminded me of my duties to you. She said she found me through a private detective. And sincerely, you owe her a lot of things. She called every day since then to know how everything is coming along. If you wait too long, you might meet a call. Wow. Anita, I have to go now, sir. Thank you again. Thank you. Thank you. I have to go. Uh, 
I'm home now. Let's talk later. Johnny, Johnny, what's popping now? Anita was the one who got in touch with the lawyer to get in touch with me to get my inheritance. Wait, it you rush the sentence. What did you say? Anita had a hand in me getting my inheritance. I need to see her, but ah, I feel so bad with the way I left her. If it's that one, no, it is not your fault, Jerry. Who would stay after collecting beating because the father doesn't want you? Besides, you rejected 5 million from the father. I beg, just go and see her to thank her, but don't think you did anything wrong by running away with your life, I beg. Okun, how far about the money where they hold me now? I go give you now, no worry. If they owe me money, you can't cross road anyhow. If you want to jam me now, who go pay me my money? So because I don't owe you money now, make I no come out again, Abi. Abba, please make you talk with that in a bag. Anita. Johnny. I don't know what to say. The lawyer told me everything. I told him not to. I'm glad he did. Anita, thank you so much. Before my body was filled with mouth to thank you. It won't be enough to convey how I feel. You're welcome, Johnny. I'm glad to be of help. And I'm so sorry for everything. The way I left. Hey, that wasn't your fault. I should be thanking you for rejecting my father's money. You proved you had dignity, which is what almost everybody in my life lacks. I am sorry for putting you through all this mess. I just feel guilty. Now things didn't work out between us. You don't have to. It wouldn't have worked anyway with all that stress from left, right and center. Besides, I am traveling to Canada for my masters and long distance doesn't work for me. Wow. I wish you the same too. I wish you the same too. Thank you again and goodbye. I can't believe my good fortune. Wow. Oh, Mo. Thank God the bullet hit where you can survive. Oh. Where I won't start from if anything happened to you. The police were able to get the CCTV footage around. I'm hoping one of the cameras captured the person responsible for this. Yes, I'm the only one at home today. My friend is still recuperating in the hospital. Eh, hey, yeah. I wish him speed recovery. Thank you. Even though you seem to be hiding him from me. I'm not hiding you. I told you we made an agreement to stay off women for a while. Unfortunately or fortunately, I couldn't keep to my own end of the agreement. How can I miss a damn cell like you because of one verbal agreement? <laughs> lie, lie. <laughs> When the time comes, I would introduce you to. Okay, oh. I wonder how your friend will feel being alone at the hospital. Hello, Johnny. How do you know my name? It's my job to know the patient. I'll be in charge of when I'm on duty. Miss White. You are very quick to know people's names, too. Are you a psych? <laughs> Let's take a look at that shoulder, shall we? You'll be good to go home in no time. The men were caught on camera and have been apprehended. Whoa, that's good though. Thank God. Johnny, didn't you hear what the lawyer said? Yes, I did. I am happy they have been apprehended. But I'm looking for the nurse that attended to me yesterday night. 
I don't know if it was real or I was dreaming. The nurse is so beautiful. <laughs> when people escape death and begin to seek for God, you escape death and begin to seek for woman. It's a good sign you're fully ready to go home. We the man, Ulu Shu. Is this where you live? Well, for now. Ugh. What? I know it's not classic and... It doesn't even have a class. Anyway, at least sit. Where? Well, you can sit on the chair. Ah, uh, no, thank you. I, I, I will stand. You can't even hide your displeasure. I do imagine this place as where you are living now. I didn't exactly come off as someone who lives in a mansion. Yeah, but I, I didn't exactly think you'd be living in this kind of place. And think you bring a woman into this kind of life. You know what? I, I really can't stay. Oh. You only just came now. Okay, let's go and hang out somewhere else. No, 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 no. I should go, I beg. This place is only for a while, though. When this while is over, you can check me. I am not the stick with a man through his wilderness period kind of girl. Bye, I beg. Madu, I thought the same man can smell money. So she couldn't smell the upcoming money in my body. <laughs> doing today Johnny you are real wow of course I'm real why would you think otherwise because I didn't think angels existed in the midst of men very funny I see you'll be discharged tomorrow really most patients are usually happy to be discharged you don't seem so happy to be discharged I just think I would miss out on a chance to know the beautiful nurse on night duty so you rather stay in the hospital to know me better than be out of here living your life? Or we could do a crush course right now. I don't follow. You could sit with me and tell me all about you in one night. Uh... You shouldn't say no to a hospitalized man, especially one who escaped death. Trying to emotionally blackmail me, huh? But okay, I'll stay. <laughs> Thank you. Let's start with your real name. My name is White. No way. You are an African and you bear white. Oh, you are serious. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Now to other things about me. That bastard is the reason she left me. What? How will I get their property now? All my plans are ruined. He has to pay for this. He can't ruin all my plans. I've dubiously been planning for years now and just go scot free. No, I refuse to let this happen. That foolish girl, she doesn't know the damage she has done. Yes, I know. I know the perfect punishment for him. Death. He will die. And I will make sure that happens. Yes. <laughs> Hello, is this Red Eye 102? Yes, I need your service very urgently. What for? Hmm, <laughs> to kill a damn soul. So, would you tell me where my lovely Kiatika for the past week is from? Me? Um. It doesn't really matter, does it? Of course, it does. I want to know whether you come from my side because of our strong level of connection, you know? <laughs> you are not serious. I'm certainly not from your side because our people aren't as fair as you are. Even if I am, like I said, it doesn't matter. If you don't want to tell me where you are from, at least tell me your name. Or do you want me to be calling you Miss White? You're speaking as if we've we'll seen each other after you've been discharged. I feel we will. <laughs> Your feelings are unstable now because of the sedative recently administered to you. I prefer to be called Miss White. Johnny? The only Johnny of the Aprocos from the Ifi tribes. The only Johnny that can dodge a bullet 
to his heart and escape death while looking him in the eyes. Oh my, <laughs> you're a confident one. But you shouldn't be too confident. The blood that runs through your veins now, in as much as may be from your thin skin ancestors, you must thank your friends for bringing you here early. That to come with the bricklayer tools as a head. Me, thank him. Never. The only thing that will make me hold him is for putting me in this room under the care of an angel like you. Oh, please, stop with the flattery. One more word and your bag will burst. You should get some rest. See if you'll be discharged soon. But I didn't even get to know more about you. Like I said, that is unnecessary. Maybe if you're treating me again in the future under different circumstances, then maybe we can have a decent conversation. I can just smell it. It's our destiny to meet again, my love. In the nearest future, maybe. But to me, but to be together, it's our star. Ah, that baby boss my head. I swear down. I need you to gather all in terms on those men's background, career and criminal histories, and other relevant requisites. I believe it was an ambush, a planned attack. They didn't rob him of anything, they just shot him and fled. It is really strange and suspicious. Do you think there is someone who would want to kill this person under consideration? Do you mean Johnny? Yes. Well, it may have been. but. His family. I suggest you tell me everything I need to know, sir. So I can provide you with enough intel and evidence you need to charge the offender. He has an uncle. Recently won him in a lawsuit over his father's property. He really looked pained. But not to that kind of... I will put him on top of my list, sir. But... I'm just making a wild guess. It's up to you to decipher the clues the orchestrator is planting for us to catch him. Okay, sir. You need not worry. It will be done as you expect it. Thank you. May I ask, sir, is this Johnny a co-worker or a close friend to you? No, but we may have come to grow a fondness of one another or some sort. I will get back to you. But could it possibly have been? No, it can't be. <laughs> Johnny and his multiple enemies. Who would imagine a carefree man like that would have so many people around his neck? And time will come, you go do it upon that your rubber mouth. They call me uncivilized. The food won't leave you run. Now you cook this food. What you know they talk, Sev? You know go feel cook this kind of delicious food. Eh uh -huh. You know the kind hunger where they wire me for ye? Why are you they hide me now? Nah? You know go jubilate say your friend don't they get him body back. And why will I jubilate? Yes, you can be fine now, but what of later? Which part of your body will they shoot next? Lucky boy, answer me. Answer me now. Is that what you are dropping face for? Like shit. Forget those people. Wherever they are, they probably think I'm dead now, self. So, they won't disturb any of us again. At least for now. For now, okay. So, I don't even see Johnny. Johnny, oh. We have to do something about these hooligans. You don't know when they will show up next, where and which part of our bodies they will aim next. Come on for there. I see if you did the one of the collect bullets. You follow me collect bullets. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Sorry, sorry. Just remember, ransack your brain. Try to remember something about those gunmen. When go fit help the lawyer find them. It be like say, eh. Hey, wait. I did your front. Eh, uh -huh, camera. What in the corner more? What do they used to call that thing that they put inside hotel and shopping more? I no understand what you they talk for Mato. Which one be camera camera where then they put for mall and hotel again? It be like saying that your brain the gun affect self. You mean CCTV cameras? Lawyer, lawyer. Ah, why did you come all the way here to see me again? Didn't you have to? I don't even know what it's been feeling like, self. I just came to check up on you, to see if you are doing well and recovering fast. Yes, 
Oh, sir, you know my bones and blood were forged from Amadeo and Ashanto's spine and sweats. I can work very well now, sir. But still can't fry plantain without wearing goggles. That's very nice to hear. Has your memory of the events we suffered more vividly now? Please don't stress your mind if you can't still recall the entire thing. I promise to first tell you anything first if something comes in my brain. What of the investigation, sir? The investigator has some leads but has to clarify his findings. I had two of the best police spies in the region and they will infiltrate the attackers at their vulnerable moments. Then, the arrest will be conducted. Oh, Mo, that sounds fun, no? Like Tom Cruise. Can I follow you guys? Why would you? You would be recognized as soon as you step foot on the way down. Plus, I think you should get much rest. Things have been stressful for you lately. And what of you, sir? Don't worry. I am used to stress by now. Are you sure those are the men that attacked Mr. Johnny? That's why we are here. All my investigations point to them. They are battalions under the Black Bed Gang Circle. Most of the members are assassins, skilled thugs, brutal criminals of all. The day you were assassinated, one of its members were caught around the area, the same tattoo on his right arm. And worst, they are all under 25. They are leaving. Let's go. Why are you still burning your face when I'm next to you? It's like I'm a ghost now. I will soon turn someone to a ghost very soon. What do you mean by that? It's none of your business. <laughs> Just carry on satisfying me and I'll make sure you are also happy. So that is all I am to you. Your satisfaction object. Why do you keep objectifying me like this, Sean? I ask of your well-being and you hide your problems from me. You will still be the same person to accuse me of cheating with another guy and later deceive me with fake promises. And what is your problem now? You know one thing I hate about you the most? Is this your uncalled for nagging? Just because I told you not to worry about my troubles, I have now become the bad person. I, I didn't call you a bad person. I only ask why you are hiding this from me when I'm so open to you. It's, it's like I'm the only one trying in this relationship. You are really getting on my nerves, Julie. If I don't want to tell you something, is that now a crime? You don't tell me everything about yourself, do you? You don't tell me. Have you still told me why you hate when I asked about your father? I've told you to stop asking. Eh? So, I'm telling you not to be sympathetic towards me. As far as I know it, my problem doesn't bother you, so let's leave it at that. You're very harsh, Sean. Thank you. And I am handsome. You don't hear anyone but yourself, eh? I will walk out of here if you continue behaving like a five-year-old. You are just... Hello? Yes? Um, um, how? I'll be right there now. Just hold on, just hold on, I'm coming. Sean, what's the matter? I'll, I'll be right back. Who called? Who did I tell you just now? What? the police now. Tell them to surround the zone. They shouldn't enter until either of us comes out. Got it? On it. What do you mean by either one of us? I mean, I will stay and try to distract them from suspecting the authorities coming in to apprehend them. You will sneak out and signal the men to come in and arrest them. Copy? Cuckoo. All this thing you are saying, how are you sure we, we can pull this off without them noticing us? Can't you see their big eyes? I beg. Let's call back up. I can't die a day after my return date. 
calm down. It will all be fine. Just focus on your road. Stay close behind me. And on my signal, run out to meet him. Wait, don't be scared. Wait, what again now? Huh? Oh, Benny, shut up. I did your front and you see the talk rubbish. You won't make I empty this gun inside your head. See how they shake. Officer of the law. <laughs> really? Oh, God. If you kill us, this is game. We are worthless. Honestly. So, no waste your time. Just allow us make we go, I beg. Tell us, where is your leader? We're not gay leader. Even if we get, what do you want carry him do? We will be at the front of the rest of you when you go to jail. Huh? Drop your weapons now! You, lie down before I scatter your head! My head, oh! My head! I've been doing already bottling to every guy. So, as we are the front badu, we are not get jazz, eh? We have to take them to the station for questioning. I understand, sir. Please, can I ask that phone a question? Sure, job, with that one. So, you even be small picking. Do you know who this man is? I know Sabi. Look at it. I say I know Sabi. You know there with us. But he has the same tattoo you have. Now for him right hand. Okay. At least you have an idea of where Sir, we will do our jobs. Run them up. Thank you, sir. So if he's not part of them, which hell did they send him from? Any lights. I saw her running off as the police came in. I assume she's one of them. She has a lot to tell us. Talk! The person you're looking for is the leader of a gang similar to the one my boyfriend is in. I'm guessing your boyfriend is that rascal who jumped on us earlier with that omniscious character. He's not a bad person. He's just there. Enough of the chit chat. Tell them what you told me. The person is the leader of Heli Light. It's a very tribal cult. Its members are mostly older and more devoted men from the towns and rural areas. They groom younger and desperate kids on the city streets into entering and working for them. I heard his name is Otto. He is the youngest but the leader. Most of his power comes from the support he gets from the elders of the... And do you know where they hold meetings? A town nearby. You will lead the way. Koffa! Sorry for the location. That's the list of my worries. What I am most worried and agonized about is the fact that this red soul is still roaming on this earth after ruining my chances of living higher than my standards. When did you want the job done, sir? As soon as possible. Yeah, I trust you will do the work accordingly. You won't be disappointed. And please, three precise bullets, if you know what I mean. Mm. <laughs> the job is already done. Johnny? Oh, Johnny! Oh, I wish we never crossed paths. Say you don't sabi everything with your answer. Lawyer say me cannot tense myself up. Say na easy question them go give me. Everything lawyer this, lawyer that. You know they think your brain they think again. If I hear, jealousy won't kill you. Wait for me and beg her to come. God, ah, God. Why be saying I went favor one show for our lives? This kind of rubbish can't happen. Person one hammer, but I hope you are feeling a lot better now, Mr. Isenkwe. Much better, sir. There is no need for you to be tensed. Just relax. We just need to ask you a few questions that will help us with our ongoing investigation on this case. Okay, sir. Okay. When they drove past you, 
Did you see that car plate number? No, sir. Now from back then, shoot me. All right. Did you sense anyone following you as you were walking on the streets that afternoon? No, sir. Hmm. Have you been threatened by anyone before? Concerning anything? Whether it may be light or full on threats? Not that I know of, sir. And girlfriends? Divorced wives? Ah, sir. Make you not even go there. I have no experience with girls. And what do you mean by that? It means that I have not had the proper relationship since I turned an adult. Hmm. Interesting. Ah. How is that one interesting now? One last question before you go. When last did you receive a phone call before the attack? Sir, I'm not too sure about... I can't really remember, sir. Okay, that's alright for today. Thank you very much for your cooperation. We will try our possible best to find out who your attackers and bring them to justice. Yes, thank you, sir. <laughs>
left her to look really strange. This place looks more like a wasteland than a street. Isn't that where criminals is? We will survey the area. Let's go. Is that how you show your courtesy in a new environment? It's him, right? On three, we look back. One, two. You can't ask me what you want to. Mm, sir, why did you pick us up and bring us to your house? Is anything wrong? We think say you won't tell us about the investigation, but you've been dealing road with the papers for over an hour now. Oh, I'm sorry. That's very unbecoming of me. The reason I actually brought both of you here is for you to help me identify something. Identify? Yes. To tell me if you know what something is. Mm, as I've been waiting the means, sir. But firstly, Johnny, how did you do with the police? It wasn't as scary as I thought it would be, sir. They went easy on you considering you were just recovering. But let's focus on why I brought you here. Are you familiar with this? No, sir. I don't know what this document is, sir. I know Sabi too, sir. It's a property transfer document and it was requested by your uncle. I saw it in one of the documents that was provided to us during the case. Property transfer? Who? Who will my uncle want to transfer property to? His wife died a few years ago along with his five children in a fire accident and the only son he had left that school in town was killed in a mob. He has no one, like nobody but himself. Who would he want to transfer the property to? Send a property where you know even get. That's the same question I wanted to ask you. But if I may ask you another one, do you know of anybody named Unsulu? Sir, it is time to call your daughter. What is the time? 5 p.m., sir. Get me my phone. Did you have something bad for lunch this afternoon? Dial a number and put it on speaker. On the table, then leave. So, so sorry, sir. What is the matter? He isn't speaking, sir. Give it to me. Hello, Dad. Hello, dear. How is Canada? I'm surviving. Is the environment okay? Why did you call me that? And um, did Bimbo remind you again? I, 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 uh, uh, oh, goodbye, Daddy. I want to cross the road. Wait. I just wanted to tell you that insolent and unfilial girl. She does not know when someone does best thing for her. How I wish she was like you. I could have known it was a trap. I did. What do you mean? Backup is on its way. We just need to keep these fools here for a few minutes and try a clue to where their boss is. Hey, hey, hey! Are you planning something right in front of me? You don't think he's the attacker? He can't be. They ain't risking coming out their shell and facing the authorities like so. They are more reserved and lay low. You know more than this. I can apprehend, Chief. Hey, you. Yes, yeah, you. The big mouth. Your mom has been rushing ever since I called you guys for the first time. Grab him. Knee both of them down. And open that parrot mouth. This place you are in. Not be your station, though. Now your hell be this. Hell. Shit. You are not police. You are not army. You are not SWAT. So who are you? I should be asking you that question. This your mouth. I will just plug it out for you. Huh? Tell me who you are. I will send you. Or this policeman will die. Get home safely. And please, lay low for now. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Don't worry. All will be well. <laughs> 
What is it, sir? Mrs. White just called. They said there's something we should come see. Miss White? Does she know about the case too? No, well not specifically, but she said a man was rushed into the hospital a few hours ago and now he was stable. He told her he wanted to confess. He also had a strange tattoo on his right arm. Be like, say everybody done they get tattooed this day. Ah, we should. We should be going then. Are you sure you want to follow? Why not? He may be one of the attackers. I won't see if he's making no waiting day in mind. Where he go kill fellow human being with the hustle. Now gang member John, them know they send human being. I won't go as well collect something. Make una they go. I will meet you not there. You don't want to talk, eh? I go slit in truth for your front. If you don't want to tell me who sent you now. I am an investigator. I don't work with or under the government. I work for myself and under myself so I can throw useless men like you in prison. You want to throw me in person? It is like you don't know who you are dealing with and what you are messing with. This is beyond you. Or that investigator. So let me advise you stay away from this case and stay away from this town because the next time I see you, you will die. You aren't the boss. Where is he? A coward like you can't be the boss. Take me to him now. You are really annoying me, or that investigator. Do you want me to skin you alive? I know you guys are, and I know who sent you. I want you to take me to where your boss is, or this fool dies. Tell me now. Yes, they are all round up. Take this man and extract all you need from him. I have more investigation to do. I'll take care of him. Thank you very much for your assistance all this while. The attackers and the leaders of the dangerous court are still at large. We need to pull our resources together to bring him to justice. Why is it now all these things are happening to me, God? If this is what will bring, bring me good fortune, and what happens when the, good, when the poor wants to become rich, then I would have never wanted it. Hi! So many people are stressing over my case. And, and this, this, this thing don't tire me, Seth. Before it has started, before it has started, I wonder who I have offended so deeply Johnny. that wants to kill me. Johnny! Sorry, sorry, sorry. I was just... You shouldn't have come if you weren't fully strong. No, I'm where? Where is the man? Yes, the boy actually... It looked like he was in a fight with a certain number of people because of some ligaments he had broken. His ankles was also disjointed and... And the obvious cut, deep cuts in his stomach and the head. Someone or some people wanted to kill him. When he regained consciousness, he started yelling he wanted to confess. As to what? He said he wanted to speak with the police about being in a gang and, and their evil acts. We gave him sedative an hour ago, so he could, be, he could be awake by now. I called the policeman working on John's case since he mentioned being in a gang and called you afterwards. They are inside asking him some questions. Thanks for calling. Shall we? What are you telling me? That it was with people all day? And you still couldn't kill him? Three precise shots. How little will you order me to? He needs to be alone, sir. But he has been with people all day. I don't care, man. It's your job to keep tabs on him and kill him in his vulnerable moments. Oh, am I meant to teach you about your own job now? No, sir. You promised me you will be dead before next week, but it's already a day before the week starts, and I still smell his existence. It infuriates me. 
Look here, I have paid you for this, and I hate when my money is not spent in vain. I want you to end that man's life before tomorrow, no matter what it takes to do so or else. I'll hand you. Eh, I say meet me opposite at Sunday's shop. I will go meet lawyer after. You say waiting? Eh? Eh? Hello? Hello? The line they break will speak up. On another sea road. I hope say today na good day. I've been the tell you important thing you caught call. Not be say I caught. Na the line they break. What you won't tell me? You first tell me waiting the doctor tell you. I'm a guy. I don't even understand this matter again. Everything they confuse me. What happened? As I reached the hospital with the lawyer. Guy, talk well, make I hear you now. I say, as I reached the hospital with the lawyer. Do you have any family? No, sir. All of them died since. Now only me and myself for this world. You don't have any guardian? Sir, I'm telling you it's me and myself that has taken care of me all this while. Nobody helps me help myself. Do you have any affiliations with courts, groups or gangs? Do you? Yes, sir. I was part of a gang. I have been part of my whole life since my parents died. They trained me to be strong in life and never let anyone bully me or use me without my permission. And what is the name of that gang? Who created it? Who is the private, who is the present leader? What are the crimes you have committed for the gang's sake? I think you should go easy on him, sir. Trust me, I can handle my job well, lawyer. As I was saying. He's the one. He's the one that told us to kill. What are you talking about? Who is the E? You were sent to kill this man? Y yes, sir. You and who? Me, three other boys and our leader. Our leader said they would be the one to shoot him. And what's the name of your leader? You said they wanted to confess, Mr. Olainto. So I suggest you do so. His name is Otto. He's the leader of our division, the Early Light. He's the one who shot him and he will continue to kill because he's a skilled assassin. Please just kill me before after this because I'm as good as dead. I was tired of their rules and acts that way. That's why I tried to oppose him. Look at where I am now. Just in my life, officer. I'm useless and a blemish to humanity. Oh, young man, you have a lot of use to us. And more than you can comprehend. You are safe from now on. That's all you should know. Since you left because you were tired of seeing such treacherous acts being committed, you can help us. Ow. By telling us everything we need to know about your former gang. Hell or uh, sorry, Hellicide? Heli light. My bad. We are listening. And that's how he was narrating one long story about their gang and ancestors and Kingsmen. It bored me so I even saw his wife sleeping with her eyes open. You know serious. <laughs> Something will concern your life with this some joke. The whole matter don't tire me. At least now we don't sabi who the attacker is. Now who send now we never know. Who be the attacker? Now they are wicked leader now. Our hate mate self. But in wicked. Don't do plenty things where really I know fit talk. The boy say the leader accepts the offer because him just won't raise him in rank for their secret society. See, I know fit even explain him. And the person will send that you fit guess? It's my uncle. We think we make it talk like that now. All evidence point to him. Plus the boy talk say. The person will send them, call himself Moon Tiger. Now wait till Uncle they call himself. Na coincidence, Johnny, coincidence. Now you sabi. If na him, I no go surprise. Ah, uh, what in the work you got? You just say your uncle hire person to kill you cold blooded. Like that. Just because of money you did. What do you want make I do? He won't give property where my papa live for me to continue his lineage. So another person. I no sabi. Now we are no green, same person to shoot me. What did I go do? What did make I do? Oh God, what did make I do? Sorry, no cry, oh. sorry, no cry, no cry. 
God day. We could chop they go wherever they go. All the plans of our enemies go they put to shame. Amen, amen. Clean eyes are big. Clean eyes are big. See as you they cry like five months old elephant. <laughs> you the <didn't> mens. <laughs> I didn't know that you like chicken so much. There are many things you don't know about me. Well, that is why we are on a date, right? When is your older brother coming back from the States? You seem to care only about my older brother. Anytime we are conversing... You are the one thinking that way. He's been gone for over five years, but you told me he's on a public relation bachelor's degree program. I just want to know if he's fine and all. Remember, we were good friends. All right, he is well. What of Sean? Oh. <laughs> Come on. How is he? How are you guys doing together? It's there. Feel me free. And I'm trying to move on my life. Have you guys broken up? Not that it really matters. It does. Is that why he has been ghosting me all this while? I don't know for him, Abdul. Let me just talk about him, please. Okay? Fine. I'm sorry. I have to go to the restroom. I'll be back in a jiffy. B but you mess up again. Not again. I wonder who let you in. This good for nothing security people. Security! Security! Sir, please wait. Before you say anything, please give me a chance to speak. Which chance? Tell me which chance. I was blind when I chose you for my daughter, given your present financial condition. Because of your incompetency, my daughter hates me. Oh, please, sir. She has always hated you. With a strict imposition of what you think is right or not, it's fair all our respect for you is gone. I just came to ask a favor from you and you are hauling insults at me. How dare you say that to me, you wretched piece of junks. Don't you ever mention something like that to me again. Me and Anita relationship is not for you to criticize, you incompetent gold digger. And please, do not accuse me of such a shameless act. Sir, in what way exactly have I shown to what to extract your asset from you, eh? I was just too foolish too blind to see it all. She had told me you were a wicked man, with no heart, but I was too consumed. By your own ego, right? <laughs> I may be heavy to your daughter, sir, but I am sure my heart don't differ from yours, sir. What do you mean? You know exactly what I mean, sir. Will you tell me right now what you are trying to say? How did your wife die, sir? That is none of your business. Oh, sir, but it is. You see, my contract with you, sir, as well as with my father states that my employee under my company, which in this case was your dead wife, and that had any relations with anyone in your company, including yourself, should be rectified from the staff immediately and fined for violation of the company's rules. I, I, what? <laughs> <laughs> my father's complaint is mine now, and so his former employees were also mine. You knew very well the Bora was going against the complaint's rules, but seeing you and wish seeing you, yet you somehow convinced her ah, your pretty love story was going have a happy ending. Pathetic. So your father was the one who. Your father? Don't cry, sir. Your lover got what she deserved. Well, my father wasn't aware of him firing her and disgracing her in front of the entire company. Would eat her like a heavy blow. She drank a pill when she entered the bedroom to wash her face from shame and never came out alive. Pity her daughter. Her daughter has to live a life unknown of her origin. How long have you known this? How long did you keep this from me? Longer than I want to know. You see, we are the Agbere Bulls, 
and no one messes with us. Now, will you listen to what I have said to you? What is it you want? Hmm. It's best you don't shout, sir. You don't want to wake up your dead wife. Easy, sir. Easy. Tell me what you want exactly. You rats. Now we are retalking. Bring it in. What is that? Hmm. You will not get away with this. But I already have. You are sure you have never heard that name before? No, sir. I went home yesterday to check all my photo album and other document to see if I see any name like Insulu, but I did not see. I have been thinking about the name since, but nothing is coming to my head. I feel so. So I made my own research. Your own research? Eh, it's good, sir. Since you have all the electronics and everything. I used the background check the investigator ran on your uncle to extract more information about any family. Except you, he asked. That Felicia didn't seem to have any affiliation to your family in any way, and it was hard getting information about her also. She would be a girl my uncle fancy and is keeping as house girl or something. Or she may be more than that. We don't know. But my attention shifted when I saw this. It's a name change application slip, and your surname is in it. There is no photograph, and the letters are blood. The investigator was able to get this when he searched your uncle's, your uncle's house the last time. I took it to a text forensic lab to help make out the info on it or create a duplicate with the, with the data on, but they are still working on it. But I seem to have noticed an N in the beginning of the former name right here. Excuse me. Hello? What? What were his exact words? Okay. Please wait, let me record this call for future evidence. Put the phone close to your mouth so I will know it's an official statement. Okay, sir. I have done that. I'm listening. We are talk now. Nah, nah, Mr. NC Quay sent us to kill your nephew. Eh, continue. He promised us share from the property he go collect from his nephew and after we kill him, and promotion from the gang with day. Him say, him say make we shoot at come carrying body and taboo so he go be like saying an animal killer. But we be they do fast fast because with the main road way many people they pass. We no plan and when now our, now our boss Otto tell us to injure each other as punishment and kill everybody we won't come investigate the matter. And where is this Otto? He don't leave the country since. He put chief apparatus in place of him. But that one died of stroke a few days ago. Now why that small boy can't deform leader for us? Everything just scatter. Mr. Izinkwe, has he also fled the country? I guess now today, he won't go one meeting for just. I beg me gonna no kill. I need to call. I wanted to call you just. You are already there. Johnny. I am very sorry you have to hear this or be involved in this. It's okay if you don't want to. Let's go. Eh? Make we go arrest that madman. To be fast, these people will be here any moment from now. Why did it have to come to this? All because of a stupid mistake. Uncle, where are you going to? Or are you going for another long trip? Go and finish your work. I just want to visit a friend, and I'll be back before midnight. But it looks like you're packing the whole house. Don't annoy me, you this little witch. It is because of that your useless excuses of a brother. All this is happening. Ah, what are you saying, Uncle? Uncle, please stop. It's paining me. And where do you think you are going to, Mr. Isenkwe? Eh? Huh? Where are you taking the road?
See as this place don't turn markets, please. You are here. Where is he? Uncle, you discourse. You have accomplished in taking all my joy and happiness away from me, right? This is what you and your useless father wanted. Now you have succeeded. You will never be happy with everything you have stolen from me as long as I live. You mean everything you have forcefully and illegally taken from him, Mr. Unzikwe? It's best to save your words for court and prepare yourself a lawyer because you have been charged with stealing, conversion of chattels, affiliation to illegal and unregistered organization, and many more crimes. See this one. Under which evidence? You will get to know in court. What you wanted to show me? Yes, this way. I saw this under her bed. It's a girl certificate. Seems like she's not from here and she doesn't have a son name. I can't really comprehend everything here, so I needed to ask what to do with her. Should we detain her? No, not yet. Uncle, why do you hate me so much? You have done a lot for me since I lost my mom and dad. And that is why I will not judge you for anything. Please, just tell me why. Why? What? If you wanted the property so badly, you could have told me and I could have given it to you. <laughs> you think it's about the property? You discriminate fool. This is why you will never be fit to manage all the inheritance. You and your father are useless to this family. All the properties he was able to gather was because of me and me alone. And now, instead of him to pay his due, he give it to you. Hmm. Kill me now. Let me just not see the next day. It is better than knowing every day my hard end work is being enjoyed by an incompetent bottom like you. And, Ellie Lights, since when were you part of them? What, what, what are you talking about? Why do you look surprised? I already know you are part of them. Part of who? Me? That's enough, Mr. Nsekwe. You have to be taken to the station for questioning. It is the best you remain silent. I want to thank all of you for your support in this investigation. So many things I didn't know before, I got to know during the course of this case. Thank you, all of you. Are you sure you want to take her under your wing? She's my responsibility from now on. She has to come with us for questioning, you know? Not immediately. Shocked by all this. We can bring her when she's gotten herself. I can't believe we don't finish the case. I can't thank you enough for all you have done for me, sir. Because you shouldn't. I fight for justice, and that is what I did for your case. But you did so much. It's alright, Johnny. I will do the same for any other person. So now we are party party now, sir. I don't know for you, but I feel you will be too busy from now on to have time for me. Oh, now, don't say that, sir. Even if I have other businesses and properties to manage, I would always have time for the people who help me in my life. You are leaving so early. My shift is over. Plus, I need some rest. What are you two talking about? I was about leaving. I will see you later, Johnny. Okay, sir. Goodbye, sir. Are you two not siblings or...? <laughs> no. I'm fortunate to know someone like him. And how did you get to know someone like him? A special person that came into my life. But that's in the past now. Mm, interesting. I thought Okon was the most special person in your life. Hey, wo. <laughs> I beg, no. That don't know I'm managing. Eh? He's like a brother, but don't think in that way. Oh. I am not. It's interesting how you have so many people on your side. Not really. I'm just fortunate to know some good people, I think.
What about you? I thought it was clear that I didn't like speaking about myself. Oh, sorry. No, um, I'm sorry. There's not really anything about me that is worth talking about. Why do you say so? For one, my father's name is Blackie. Eh? His name is Blackie White? Yes. <laughs> now, I'm more interested in knowing about you. For watching our video before you go please click the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell to see more of our videos thank you as you do so